Okay, hello. This is a podcast on how to create a podcast and upload it to YouTube for the Milton High School Geometry page. So uh, we're going to walk you through the process. The first thing we need to do is we need to uh, make sure you have a Bluetooth that is paired with your computer. That's very important. If you don't have a Bluetooth that's paired with your computer, uh, this doesn't work. So uh, talk to tech, get that done, get that set up. I can help you with that as well, but that would be a different uh, instructional training. Once that's done, the first thing we want to do is you want to choose System Preferences. And I'm on the wrong screen here, so hold on. Under System Preferences, when we go there, um, we will choose Sound. And you'll make sure that your device that you're using, your Bluetooth, is the one that's hooked up and receiving the sound. You can tell it's receiving the sound because you see it here on the input level. So you want to make sure that uh, you see these little bars flashing down here that tells you that your input device is actually working. Once you've got your Bluetooth paired and ready to go, uh, now you can go ahead and start your recording. To do that, we go to QuickTime. And the QuickTime is the Q here. with looks like a circle almost with the blue in the center. That's QuickTime Player. We go ahead and click on that. You'll notice that it looks like nothing happened when I clicked on it. But in fact, if you look at the top of your screen, it now says QuickTime Player up here, File, Edit, Share, View, Window, um, which is what we want. Under the QuickTime Player, we go to File, and we're going to choose New Screen Recording. Excuse me, New Screen Recording. Not new audio or video, but New Screen Recording. So we click on New Screen Recording. You'll notice that it's showing also the sound pickup here, right beneath everything. So. Uh, if your Bluetooth isn't working, it actually won't allow you to do a screen recording. So you want to make sure that's working. Uh, we click the red button, which you think would start the screen recording, but it doesn't. It just brings up another menu says, are you sure you want to start the screen recording? If you're absolutely sure, yes. And by the way, be sure to read the instructions. It says, after recording starts, you can stop by clicking the um, stop recording in the menu bar, which you'll see up top here, or pressing command control escape either way. Now if you aren't, um, if you're a notebook like you're probably going to be and will be in a second, you will have to click back to QuickTime to get the stop recording button back, but that's okay. So we start recording and we go ahead and record whatever it is we're going to record. We record, we go down to our smart board software, maybe we draw a nice little picture of a triangle, whatever it is that we're doing that day. We record our podcast. When we're done, we go and cl click on the QuickTime player icon again and just click on Stop Recording. Once it's done, we have our video recorded, and you'll notice it has a name up here, and it's saved. It's gone ahead and saved it for you. You don't have to do anything special. It is already saved into your movies file. Now we're to the point of needing to upload it to YouTube. Uploading to YouTube is a fairly simple process. We go into our internet browser, and we type in the window, uh, to go to www.youtube.com. Right now I am not signed into YouTube because I'm not signed into my Google account. YouTube is hooked up through your Google account. Uh, we go ahead and click on the sign in button, which is a little bit off my screen here, so I'll scroll over to show it. Sign in as normal. Remember, don't put that password on the first screen, only on the second screen. And you'll notice now it says this account is managed by Milton K12 right here. That just tells us uh, we are in the right account. Now, I want to be under, not under Dornem at Milton K12. I want to be in the geometry account, not that one. I sent you a link for that. It says click here to make to change accounts. Um, notice a little arrow, so I'm going to click on my picture. Now it didn't change accounts yet, but right down here there's a little selection that says switch accounts. So I do that, and I'm choosing Milton High School Geometry. And now up on top here it says we're on Milton High School Geometry, so I'm in the right place. Next, all I want to do is upload my video, and they have a handy dandy upload button right here on top of the page. We just click it. Wait a second, uh, select files to upload. Well, we're just going to tell it what we want to upload. Uh, since the last place I loaded from was my movies, it went directly to my movies file. 
and that uh, one that I just made was screen recording three. So I'm going to choose that. And while it's uploading, it goes to this screen and I can name it. I can put a description in if I want to. Oh, something just changed. It said, uh, it says it's pro uploaded videos, it's sampling, it hasn't uploaded it yet, it's 95% done, so you can see that it's working. Uh, the tags can be really useful. Let's say, for example, this was specifically about angle pairs. So maybe I want to put vertical angles and uh, maybe something like consecutive interior. Okay, things that are important in this lesson. Uh, the privacy, I leave it unlisted, uh, categories education. What that does is it means only people who subscribe to this channel can see it. It's not available to the general public. We will give all our students a link to subscribe to the channel. You'll notice the top of my screen suddenly now says upload complete. Yay, I've got a green check mark, and it gives me a link to my video. If I wanted to add more videos now, I could go over here and add another video. I go to Video Manager, or I can view my video, which would be done right here. Click on YouTube. And we go ahead and record whatever it is we're going to record. We record. And there is my exciting video that I made as part of this demonstration. And you have now uploaded a video to YouTube. Very simple. So creating and uploading videos to YouTube for geometry.